This is a wonderful story of compassion, isn't it? It is. I mean, it's uh, it's an in, uh, an inspiring story. I, I think uh, it's uh, uh, it's so unusual. I think it's very easy to forget that uh, the UK was occupied during the Second World War. Um, Ninety-nine percent of it wasn't, but part of it was, and. Uh, it's easy to forget that, that, that those islands were occupied in the same way that uh, um, occupied Europe it was taken over by uh, the Third Reich. Um, and along with that came all the, uh, the, the moral um, difficulties and choices that people had to make. Um, and this, of course, is the story of a, of a remarkable woman who, who made remarkable choices. and. Uh, um, I, I think it's a, a moving and inspiring story. And with regards to your character, I saw him very much like he was kind of no nonsense, and he played things by the book, didn't he? Because you had to. Um, yeah, yeah. Well, uh, that's why. But the story is so appealing, you know, because um, uh, in any occupied country, it seems that some people absolutely everybody does what they think is right. Some people um, have a, a, a family uh, to. to um, to look after and therefore they will go along and do whatever the occupiers ask them to do. Um, some people think actually that's not good enough. I'm, uh, uh, I'm going to take a few risks here. These people shouldn't be here and that's the decision they make and she certainly did. And, uh, uh, and we see that you're, we're all accountable for our um, Yeah, yeah. Um, it's... Um, Moving story. Yeah, it is. It is. It's. Uh, yeah. No, she, she was a remarkable woman. Yeah.